Speaking of the ball, Professor, have you selected your representative for the dance contest yet? If you don't, the contest will go on without your house. <sighs> and that would be embarrassing. Gee, thanks. I'm thinking about it, but honestly, I'm thinking everybody else is right. Though I do want to try... I know what somebody told me that was it CPU zero? No, I don't know if it was. I forget. But someone told me that everybody was saying that flaying kind of sucks, and he was interested to see how I did with flaying. And for me, flaying is starting to turn into a really good unit. But. I mean, you gotta work with them, of course. And she's got rescue, you know? When do I have to decide? That's the cup. I probably want to do it now, to be honest. Yeah, before I end this recording session, I should decide. Ah, uh, the ball. It reminds me of how I met my wife. You have a wife? I was at a village's harvest festival. There was a full moon bathing everything in its cool glow. She appeared out of nowhere, dancing gracefully in the moonlight. A lovely fairy. <laughs> well, the full moon thing was an embellishment, I admit. But you can forgive a man for waxing poetic, can't you? <laughs> anyway, we soon fell in love and tied the knot. Now we have a daughter who's as bright and beautiful as a sunny morning. You lying, bro. So, whenever I see people dancing, I think of my wife, and my heart does a little waltz. <laughs> Wait, you're serious? Hold up. You're not in my house. Ah, uh, I was... She a piece... And I can't recruit you. That's... Interesting. Hmm. You have a wife and a daughter and yeah, I can get an s rank with you! Professor, you know, Professor, I used to think I would be comfortable with all manner of experiments, so long as they provided usable results. But when I heard of Solon's work, well, I realized I'd not considered the moral and philosophical limits of what all manner of experiments might mean. Yeah? <laughs> Sorry. I'm not great with blood. Even when I'm just thinking about it, I feel a bit ill now. How are you able to be a soldier then? Or, well, not a soldier, Maybe. but... Fighting on the front lines? Now, where the heck is Bernie? Oh, she... She's here! Oh, um, I got sidetracked. There she is. The ball, a grim reminder of my sad reality. Yeah, here we go. The other nobles will be fine, I'm sure. They've all been to events like this before. But me? I'm a noble, and I've never even been close to one of these things. What's well, okay, I suppose. Bridget techniques. Oh, that's what he wanted. Okay. I wonder if Remire Village will ever be the same again. How do you recover from such a terrible event? Mm, not sure if you ever do. So many dead, so much destroyed. I can't see how the whole village doesn't just end up abandoned. Our class was also sent out to help put the village in order. But then... But then what? What happened? Well, that's sus. That's sus. And I haven't looked for her. But I have not seen Monica yet. Well, Gilbert... Thank you very much. Thanks. Hey. <laughs> Yo, Raph. The ball is coming up soon. I am so excited. I can't wait to fill up on food while everyone's dancing. 
I even heard there'll be some prime cuts of meat. Oh, yeah, I'd hope so. Apparently, there's supposed to be a dance contest, too. I think it's called the White Heron Cup. Who's gonna represent our class? I can do it if you haven't picked someone else. Ah, you can. No. Oh, really? I may not look it, but I'm actually a pretty good dancer. Nah, Raphael. I can't, I can't get rid of your crits, man. You gave me crits for days. You just need a little bit more time. Leone, this is a strong no if you're gonna... I'm glad the Remire Village situation got sorted out. But it's not over yet, is it? And I can't believe Old took the ball. Doesn't matter. I don't dance. Oh. I might show up for the food, though. Not that it's got anything to do with me. But have you picked someone to represent us for the White Heron Cup yet? <laughs> no. Well, someone's bound to want to do it. I'm sure we've got a few people with the talent to win, too. Lanley just flat out told me, yo, I don't really dance. I don't even want to go to the ball that much. <laughs> She'd be terrible in so many. That would be suicide. Literal suicide. Hmm. Where's Flane? Up there. That's right. Wait. No, seriously. All right, now I'm looking for her. Where is that little redhead? Nowhere to be found! Sus as heck! That one. <sighs> Too much merriment. The librarian betrayed us. The Death Knight is back. Is this the time to be throwing a ball? Well, you know, it's tradition. But I hear you. What's this about? The ball? Knights don't participate. It's an event for students, but... It does pique the interest of some knights in particular. Alois can't dance, but I hear he likes to watch. He volunteered to judge the White Heron Cup. Oh! Not that I care. Shamir? Shamir, you uh, you sound like you got feelings for him. Shamir? You uh, hmm, okay. Interesting. <sighs> Okay, look, let's just go, let's just be real, all right? Who am I? Honestly, it would come down to Lorenz or Flame. Because there's no way I'm getting... Lysithia and Leone are, are the aces, and Marianne is... I feel like Marianne's role is arguably more important than these two. Marianne can heal from a distance... She's also just a, she, a now a great attacker as well. If I had to bring in a group of people I thought that would just be my backup. Oh, and obviously it's not Claude. Like, no. Um, it would be Claude, Lysithia, Leone, and Marianne. Like, in every mission I go to where I fear, fear, where I feel fear, those four are coming with me. Hilda has got to be Hilda. Like, well, I mean... Shoot, I could. But my issue is I can only teach one person to be a dancer. I think from what I'm hearing right now. And it just comes, I, it would be interesting to make Hilda the dancer, especially since she doesn't like, that's, doesn't she love just supporting people? But Hilda, I feel is a diamond in the rough. I actually looked at her speed. It's the second highest. Like, look at that. Well, Ignatz also has really good speed as well. Okay, well, my speed is the same as Leonie's, right? Yeah. Oh, no, Catherine's speed is... Okay, well, point being, her speed is very good. It's just her weapons. Why did I get rid of her? I think because I wanted Hilda... Hilda just needs more speed. But her speed is good for her class. Can a dancer still... Now, here's the thing about dancers. I should specify to those of you who don't know. I'm sorry, I should have done that a while ago. So the dancer class. Normally are the class that can... When you need... You, you know, you've used up all your units... You want to move one more unit. The dancer will dance for them, and then they'll be able to move again. 
it may seem like you're just not that useful but trust me it is one of the most quintessential parts of your team whenever i bring out someone on the field i bring a dancer but the dancers have a weakness since moving a unit you know again to attack again not like leone where she moves and stops but she can keep going Moving a, a unit to attack again is an incredibly uh, powerful skill. So it has trade-offs. I think I've talked to everybody, actually. Except for, of course, who I want to dance with. Or who I want to be the dancer. The dancers are normally weak. And... They can normally only wield a physical weapon, which would honestly make Helda an interesting choice because she could be a strong dancer. If I could just know the stats of the dancers, I could try making Hilda one, but... Hello, Professor. The... I... I have never danced in front of people before. Not even once in all my life. Like, and then you got Flame saying that. I'm very much looking forward to it. Have you heard yet about the White Heron Cup? If you have yet to choose a representative, do you mind terribly if I volunteer? Understood. Oh well. Either way, I am still so excited about the ball. Like, is Flame meant to be a dancer? It's not gonna be Marianne. Like, it, getting rid of any of my important members. And now that I think about it, Hilda is our second tank. So from a, just that standpoint, it probably wouldn't make sense. Hmm. It's true, that, but that's all. Even when he... I'm still feeling but right. It's the dance this month, isn't it? Can't see how anyone would be much in the mood for dancing, considering... Although, I suppose the White Heron Cup does sound pretty fun. It would probably be more logical to ask someone who likes dancing in the first place, so I certainly understand. Okay. Well, it looks like the game is basically telling me, hey, if you pick this person, you're dumb. You're dumber than dumb. Well, no. I mean, you can always do it just because you want to. Like, for a challenge, in fact. I'm kind of thinking about that. Maybe for a third route. Time for the ball. Oh my, am I excited? Like Hilda seems like she'd be this being oh, but first the white heron cup. Who will appear on stage? I wonder. You're choosing the representative for the dance contest, isn't that right? Choose me. I'm a pro. See, Hilda's a pro. She's a pro. Oh, I was really getting excited for it. Let me know if you change your mind, huh? All right, it's either Hilda, Hilda, or Flane. Who am I going with? Come on, dude, you gotta make a decision. Hilda or Flane? The thing is, Hilda. The only thing I, uh, I don't. Mm. Hilda or Flame? Because then you also got Hilda's ability. Like, she's good as a supporting role. Whereas Flame... Hang on. Also is good for a supporting role. They both have the hearts, huh? Flames also has Miracle now, so she doesn't need to be the same class. If dancers can still use magic, which I doubt because dan that would be too OP. And that's a thing. I uh, I want to pick Hilda, but oh, I don't know if it, if it makes Hilda too weak. I it'll be a waste. And you know, it'd be something different than m most other people have done. But then it'll also make Hilda more fragile as well. And then there's a the case of, I don't have to... Uh, Hilda, what do I do? Do I make you a dancer? You're no 
know what? You know what? Let's be different. It's almost this. Oh, you're choosing the. Hilda. Great. Now that I'm in the spotlight, I'll do anything to win. I chose. All right. Hey, Professor. Care to join me for dance practice? Um... Okay. Whew. I don't think we can possibly lose. Just you wait and see. <laughs> All right, Hilda. Dad gum. Where's there she is? I hear you've chosen your representative for the White Heron Cup. In that case, a word of advice. On an average year, the winning contestant has about this much charm. Wow, you gonna tell me that after? Charm is important, wouldn't you agree? Who wants a partner with no charm? Not me. Do your best, make sure to put in the practice, and good luck. Hmm. Well, honestly, who would have had the most charm? Roster? So my charm is 50. Oh, okay. I would have claw 21. Yeah, Lorenz would have been terrible. Okay, see, uh, not, not Lorenz. My sit. <laughs> my sit has more charm than these three. Marianne 14. Yeah, yeah. I chose. So without it, Hilda would. Have Hilda has the most charm. No, I picked the right. I I, I am confident in my decision now. Most people want to pick Flame, apparently, according to the meme. But nah. Hilda has been the most charming person of the group. And she loves to slack off. And I don't want to get rid of Flame's rescue. And I get a feeling dancers can't use magic. That just wouldn't make sense. That's what my Fire Emblem sense is telling me. Now, I would stay and try to get everybody's rank up. But honestly... Oh, I haven't done my activities. All right, let's do my activities. So, first off. Hmm. Bernadetta. Let's get some more defense. Okay. What's today's special? Ooh. Huh. It's rare to see Edelgard. Th Wait, is it everybody? No, it ain't. All right. Well, they're gonna get Hilda. Wait, actually, where's Raphael? No, Raphael. That's wow. Okay. Well, that's fine, I guess. Ingrid. No, Ingrid. We do have Bernadetta, though. Who does Bernadetta have a rank with? <laughs> Leone. Well, okay. Because Leone is not on here. Neither is Raphael. Where is Leone? Oh, yeah. No, that's a, that's a no. In fact, isn't she already... Yeah, she's already maxed out anyways. Okay. Let's get Flane and Lysithia. Because now I'm thinking about it, I don't think Lysithia has an A rank. And that's odd. Yummy. Who made this? I'll have to give my compliments to the chef. Eating delicious food really takes my worries away. Good. All right, now that's done. I might come back here, honestly. Black magic? I'll bring it on. <laughs> of course I won. You know, I could have chosen Marianne though. Her resistance is incredible. Come on, I said to get that crest off. 
outmatched. Hmm. If they crit her, though, it won't matter, even if her health was at full. Yes. There we go! I just worked hard. <laughs> I was hoping her crest would just knock him out. 13? Ah, I'll go ahead and use one. I mean... Dodge? Yeah. You underestimated me. You all are outmatched. Finish them, Lysithia. I just worked harder. Easy. Of course. She's the best one in this dadgum, in this dadgum school. Ooh, silver shield. I'll take that. Maybe I could give that to Hilda. Oh, Shamir. What's this about? The ball. It's an Apollo. He volunteered. I could use some. There we go. Ooh. I still have much to learn. Needed. Thank you. Now I can do that. Who else? Rhea? I could use some more. Ooh, I got a great. I still have much to learn. Professor. Eh, recover. Okay. I don't have anything too special so far. No attack magic. Or attack white magic. Catherine, more sword training, please. And. Oh, yeah, Manuela, some more sword training, please. All right. That does it. And I think I'm going to end it here. Finish exploring. Uh, all right, let's instruct. Lysithia? I suddenly really need your magic to be at A, so that's what we're working with right now. We've got to keep working hard. Claude, I actually want your bow to be at... Um, where is it? Oh man, it's gonna be far though. What? If I want him to have his class. Let's do this again sometime. Let's do this again sometime. Uh, Leone. I guess for you, I really need your lance up, I think. Or your writing. Yeah, probably writing. Mm, but let's at least make sure you can use high level lances. I'm getting it. Alright. Master this. Not that you need that. And then some more writing. I've learned a lot. Mmm. Alright, Hilda. You gotta master your axes. That was so helpful. Thanks. Though I am curious to see what ability you get. Yeah, who's the best? I'm the best. <laughs> I'm glad I put in some effort for once. After wow, Hilda. Yeah, who's the best? I'm the best. That's two. That was so helpful. Thanks. 
Okay. Ignots. You gotta work on your bows as well. I'll keep trying my best. I'll keep trying my best. All right, and last. Hmm. Oh. I got it. Nice. I knew I could get it. Nice job. Oh, thanks, Professor. That's real nice of you to say. I got it. Nice. I knew I could get it. I feel like I've grown a bunch. All right, B. This isn't so hard. Okay. Uh, actually, do these two. All right. Um, bow. Wait, no. All right. We need to start having people prioritize because I want you to be able to use your classes as soon as possible. Mm, yeah. Mm, yeah, Lysithia, just reason for now. Marianne can stay though. <laughs> She's good. Hilda, just... Uh, yeah, just an ax. Leone just... Huh. Go with that. And... Flane! I guess I'd want you to stick with Faith. Alright, and... Get rid of the axes, just do the bows. All right. Professor, may I ask you a question? Oh. <laughs> uh. Splendid. Yeah, I thought she would like that. <laughs> that gummit. Mmm. No. Whose birthday? Ooh. Okay, well. Um, what is it? Did I do something wrong? No. You went out of your way to get my favorite tea? Oh. That's so nice. That's a good start. Thanks so much. Still too hot. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Not. Darn it. My mother works in the Imperial Capital. People there say she's a genius. L uh baby chat. Oh, darn it. This was great. I thought if I laughed at her, it would make it seem ridiculous. I am ready to begin. Oh yeah, I'm ready to roll. Finally done. Not bad. I'll take that considering you guys had a one star. Ah, oh, so close. I'm about to say nothing? Am I making progress? Okay, heal. Well worth the effort.
I know we could do some paralogs, but honestly, we did a lot last time. So let's see. Actually, yeah, I'll do this. I just really want to see the dancer, to be quite honest. Practice yields results. I feel like I get it now. I will master this. Yeah, I'm doing it. Okay. So... I'll still work on my students first. Leonie, let's work on that writing. No problem. Nice. <laughs> Nothing to get excited about. I've learned a lot. Okay. Hilda. It. And she's got it. Huh. Figure. I didn't know I had it in me. Wow, that's actually very nice for Hilda. Okay. Especially with her javelin combini uh, combining it with that. Mmm. Let's go your charm a bit. What? I thought I had it. It's all right. Stop being nice about it. Oh, it's not necessary. All right. Well, I, what? so I do need to console some people or critique. All right, Claw, you're right. You're right. So I just got to know the person. Ignatz. I'll keep trying my best. I'll keep trying my best. All right, you're close. That's all I can ask for. Flane? Keep working. Well, actually, get your bow ring just to tap it up. I understand more every day. And, and some of that. All right, and now... Hmm. Most likely, oh, nope, not Catherine. Mm, I guess Shamir. To do what, though? He's already so good. But I don't think I've worked with her, so let's just try it. What do I have to teach her about a That wasn't difficult. About a bow though. Your praise is appreciated. This is kind of ridiculous, You're honestly. A good professor. You're a good professor. Well, I mean, you can always learn something from others, I guess. You're never too skilled to not learn something. All right, change the group task because now I'm thinking about it. Probably make more sense for Leone to get some. And I think this is a possible. They can have a possible rank. Yeah, let's just begin. Professor. No. I set you guys up the way I want you. Okay. Ahem. Ladies and gentlemen, my sincerest apologies for the wait. Thank you for gathering here on the eve of the highly anticipated ball to bear witness to the Academy Wide Dance Competition. Welcome to the White Heron Cup. Good luck, Hilda. The competition will be judged by me. Your humble servant, Alois Rongel. And also, 
the acclaimed former songstress of the Mittelfrank Opera Company, Manuela Casagranda. By the way, it's unique for Fire Emblem for them to actually have last names. I meant to point that out a while ago. I like that. Yes, yes, thank you. Oh, and it should go without saying, but I swear to show no bias to my own house. Got it? Good. Mm hmm. Last but not least, the glamorous assassin who does all of her dancing in the dead of night, Shamir Navron. Uh, Shamir, you're here? <laughs> that three of us swear on our honor to judge the following proceedings with utmost impartiality and fairness. Okay. And with that, will the representatives of each house. Please make their way to the stage. Who are you going up against, Hilda? Contestants, oh! Are you ready to dance? And is the band prepared to play? To do a dancer? That seems like a terrible idea. Very well. Begin! Though Dorothea <laughs> might be a slight threat. Say that's all, folks. I say that's all, folks. Splendid. All three of you were fantastic. <laughs> now, let's hear what the judges have to say. Hilda has the highest charm of all the students that I have. Oh, my. Let's see. I suppose I have no choice but to vote for the Golden Deer House. All right. Your performance was exhilarating. My heart is still beating a mile a minute. No, to be honest, it wasn't all that. I vote for Golden Deer House. You are the most original. <laughs> Great feedback, both of you. Well then, let's see. Factoring in my own humble opinion, yes, we have a winner. And I will announce who it is right now. Without any delay. Okay. <laughs> the winner of this year's White Heron Cup is the Golden Deer House. All right. Perfect. Where's the prize? There is a prize, right? Once more, please give a big round of applause for our talented participants. Yeah, yeah. Everybody did well. Where's my dancer class? Oh, even better, I think. Like I thought, she'll wield a sword. Whose birthday? Dimitri? Thank you. Take some flowers, man. I can't get my rank All up right. with you. You better keep up. Okay, I'm good to go. Good enough, Professor? Alright, B plus, B plus. C plus, nice. Now I see the heart of it. Okay. I feel like I get it now. Good. It's starting to make sense. <laughs> I'm a natural. Perhaps I'll expand the scope of my research. Good. All right. So yeah, I guess no paralogs. I appreciate your effort. Well, let me see. Do I have any new ones? I don't. What? Oh. Oh. Mm, I did. I do. Well, that's 17. I wouldn't have taken it anyways. Okay. Well, first off. Hilda, let's see. Where is it? Where is it? Unless it's just... Um... Reclass? Oh, yeah, she already has it. Well, it's 
boring. You can vote magic? What? Oh man. Her strength goes down. Down, down, down. But her speed, dexter, everything else goes up though. Huh, our strength will only go down by one. HP by two. She could build magic. Darn it. What's all this magic? Yeah. Well, she could real will some reason, honestly. Not that I. Darn it. Since when can dances will magic? All right. Well, shoot. <laughs> Did I goof? Maybe. I mean, the dancers are supposed to use swords. <sighs> well, I made my decision, all right? And you know what? I'm sticking with it. I think Kilda will do better with swords anyways, because her speed, or I think swords are the items with the least weight. Just, they don't have that much power, I want to say. Maybe. All right, Hilda. Store the hand axe. And grab an iron sword. What's the weight compared to the others? Yeah. All right. For now, though, well, let's see. What would you look like, Hilda? Why can't I see it, though? I want to. I want to see her in that class. Oh, Flame Raphael, good. That's it. They're the only ones who got one. <clears throat> so what is this? The ball? Oh no, the chapel. Okay. I might want to go for a battle. I can't. Just, I just want to see what Hilda looks like in her class. What well, I guess I could do is this. Um. No. Inventory. I better tell my brother about this. I'm probably gonna want to take some paralogs on, even though. All right. Then we go to certifications. Hilda's. Ha! Huh. So that's how she looks, huh? She could use magic! That don't make no sense! <sighs> I mean, what do you think, guys? Does it fit? Ah. Uh... What's her, what's her defense, actually? Her defense is still 15. I'm not sure if it's such a bad idea, though, to make Hilda... I mean, she's got also... She's also good... Was this a... I don't know if it's a terrible idea. I honestly don't. Uh, I guess we'll try it. Elda's only level 17 that I'm looking at it. Wow. Mm. Okay. So that's what she looks like. And I probably will go for a battle or two next time. Now that we know who Celtis is, I might take on this one since it won't be available for much longer. And then do with a dancer. We could probably try to do this mission. And Hilda will be less, uh, what is it? Fragile? <laughs> then, uh, Flane, cause Flane only has defense of nine. Hilda's a tanky dancer, okay. Uh, we'll work it out later.
Yeah. But my choice has been made. So now we truly get to see Flame in her class. You know, if she's completely a mage. And held as a dancer. I did not go... I didn't choose who I'd like to go to the tower with. Is that important? Do I really need to go back to do that? I feel like it is. But I got so many paralogs and I need to upgrade my units. Especially now that Hilda got her dancer class. Alright. Well, anyways, let's save up. Our decision is final. <laughs> That's part of the permadeath feel. The final thing, you know, now going back on what we've done. And it's unique, you know? If Flame makes it better, I'll get to see Flame, you know, fully as her class. And I'm still going to work on Hilda's main class. Um, But if she... We're going to see how this works, so... Until then, this has been Blade. Hope you all have been enjoying, and we'll see what this choice does. And I will see you all next time. And now it's time for the question of the day. But before I begin, I just want to say this is a textbook example of why I say not to tell me anything. Because a big decision on why I chose Hilda was because of two things. One people told me that they actually chose Flane at their, as their dancer, and two, they also said that Flane is a terrible unit just normally, when you don't have her as a class. And they always said, well, she has one useful class, but other than that, so I'm assuming they meant dancer. So because of that, for me, a big part of why I like Fire Emblem, why I say, you know, permadeath, you know, why I wanted it on in the first place, is because I always like making my own strategies for things and coming up with unique ways to solve problems. So if you all tell me a way that many people have agreed is the best way, then I'm like, well, shoot. All right, well, since I know that that's the way, I feel kind of cheap if I just followed that. So I want to do something else. So this is why I ask for people not to give me advice because if you do, I'll most likely say, okay, that was what I should do. Let's try to find another way. So, not trying to say that I'm stubborn, but I just like taking accomplishments. You know, when I beat a map, feeling that it was my own accomplishment and not the Fire Emblem community who's helped me. You know, like where you guys have had so much experience watching other people, seeing what they did. Whereas I came up with the strat that some people said, huh, they'd never seen with the whole healing and unequipping weapons. Not to say that that's the most outrageous strat, just saying. I like to come up with things myself, so that is why we now have Hilda as a dancer, and we shall see how that works. And somebody also mentioned after I recorded this episode that I should make Hilda a Wyvern Rider. I was just silently thinking, well, we don't have to worry about that. Well, I mean, I could still make her one, but I'd want to keep hold of my dancer, so. But anyways, on to the question of the day, and this one's going to be... Who out of the Golden Deer house would you have made a dancer? And you can include Flane and Cyril as well, right? Uh, if Cyril can be a dancer, which I would think he can. Um, but yeah, if you would like to choose somebody, who would you choose? Uh, just this house or ask the other houses when their time comes. So please post your thoughts down in the comments below and I will see you all next time.